Today, Heidi and I embark on a little adventure heading down south for a little spring break action. Heidi's finally on spring break. Um, gonna do some fishing, but mostly it's it's more more like a vacation. Yeah. So, yep. yeah. But um, it is what is it? Seven o'clock. Uh, yeah. We've got a 7:05. We've got a 22-hour car ride ahead. We have 15 rods in this little Ford Focus, two sleeping bags, a big tent, all the camera gear. I'm not food, cooler. I don't know how we're gonna fit everything in. We still have you know, quite a bit of stuff to put in still, but we're gonna make it happen. Um, yeah, gonna be a fun little adventure. Never camped uh, down south like that. Heidi, when's the last time you went camping? Oh boy, uh, it was 10. 10, so we'll see how this goes. <laughs> Heidi doesn't like spiders, so I don't know. But today's just gonna be traveling down. Probably end up to be like a 24 hour car ride, so don't know if there's gonna be fishing in this video, but we will find out shortly here. Finally, our first stop, five hours in. Heidi, how are you doing? It's really cold still, which means we haven't made it down south yet, but it's really windy today. Uh, driving has been kind of crazy. Um, I kind of want to show you the inside of the car right now. Look at how we got the rods all fitted in. This is 15 rods and a little Ford Focus. Sleeping bags, pillows, cooler, everything. But um, finally our first pit stop. About five hours in, got 16 hours and 23 minutes left. Um, yeah, yeah, there, there's a lot left of this drive, but still okay. We were moving so good until we hit a little traffic jam in Kentucky. We made it to Kentucky. We have 14 hours and 14 minutes to go. Um, but we did pick up some pretty awesome snacks. Got flavor twisted Fritos, honey barbecue, one of my favorite trolley. snacks. Lots of trolley gummy worms. Picked up something new. We got Starburst Mini. They were kind of sour. I don't know, I'm gonna give them like a six out of 10. They were pretty dang good. Got Laffy Taffy, so yeah, we're eating really healthy. But these snacks are so essential to a road trip because you gotta stay awake and um, candy does that for you. So guys, please comment below, what is your favorite snack on a road trip? Candy, whatever. Um, trolleys is a big one for us. Very, very trolleys, pretty awesome, but. Are you still trooping? Are you, you're eight hours in. Yeah. I think eight hours in driving. Um, I'll probably take over the night shift for the most part. That's a hard part. But, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Anyways, we're moving all right. Only one hiccup so far, but we'll keep going. Well, folks, we made it through. Chattanooga, we made it through Atlanta, um, and we finally got to the state where we wanted to go in the first place. That is Florida. So, this is our last little pit stop, and um, we will be at the destination. Heidi, where is that destination? Oh boy, that is Sanibel Island. Sanibel My Island. Favorites. This is uh, Heidi's favorite place to go in Florida. Yep. Um, I'm pretty excited to go see it myself. Uh, when's the last time you've been there? Oh boy, that was probably five years ago. Five years yeah. ago, so it's gonna be cool to visit. Uh, we got five more hours before we can get to the to the island. Um, four o'clock right now. We drove through the night. We got the AC on, I am happy. Yeah, it's 65 degrees out. It's yeah. pretty awesome. Uh, no snow in sight, no, no ice, no ice fishing. Gonna finally make the first cast of 2019. Guys, we are almost there. Heidi and I have been driving for the last 24, 25 hours, and it's gonna feel really nice to get on a beach. Um, it's pretty amazing watching, I don't know, all these palm trees, there's green grass, there's no ice. Um, 
looking forward to this warm weather finally. Um, We're at 77. 77 right here. It rained quite it's a bit. Only nine. It's only nine o'clock and it's already 77 degrees. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Gonna be an awesome little day here. Who knows about the fishing, but just being in Florida right now, it's pretty awesome. Alright guys, here's the situation. Heidi and I just got on the beach. We we're just gonna, I didn't bring any rods, didn't bring any camera equipment. We we're just gonna chill on the beach, walk the beach, and then um, there's a pond right here filled with jumping fish. I think speckled trout, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. But anyways, I just got back from the car. It was a super long walk. Gonna finally cast into the salt water here. Little popper. Um, I'm gonna try first, and then it'll be Heidi's turn. Okay. Let's do this. All right, guys, first cast of 29. Oh my goodness, Heidi, oh I, almost so I almost killed you. Okay, that was a bad first cast of 2019. I almost sent Heidi to the emergency room. All right, so I think they're, these are trout um, in, this, in this little lagoon area. Wow, did I mess up here. If you were wondering, I'm a little jacked up at the moment. We just wanna catch a fish here. All right, trying that again. I don't know what that is. I think it's getting chased. I guess you guys could saw that in the on the chest cam. We had a flying fish. Maybe it is a flying fish. I mean, the, we are in the ocean. That's actually a bait fish. Um, it's obviously running away from something. Uh, threw a lot of different stuff at these fish. I don't know. They're not biting anything. So I'm gonna go with a little big bigger bait, maybe a little bit louder. I don't know. There's gotta be something big in here though. Well guys, our plan A spot did not work so hot. We were on a bunch of fish. Um, after really thinking about it, I think they were mullet. So really big mullet. Mullet don't bite, they really don't bite bait. So uh, Heidi, we're switching gears. What are we doing? Uh, we are shark fishing. Shark fishing, so that's the goal. I have not caught a shark yet. Heidi obviously has not caught a shark in her life, so. Oh. Hopefully today is yeah. the day or yeah. the week, <laughs> Right, right. So this is our first time um, really going shark fishing from shore. Did a lot of research the last week. Got some tools. Hopefully the gear I have is plenty enough for a shark. I really don't want a giant one. I just want a nice warmer upper, four to five footer. That would be absolutely awesome. So we're going to give it our uh, best shot here and uh, hopefully catch one. Well, guys, here's the bait for today. The bait shop had fresh mullet, so only got one big one of this, so I'm gonna cut it up in three pieces. Um, get that set in the water. I don't know, not, not sure what I'm doing, but get this guy all cut up here. Yummy. Oh, wow. Is it nice and bloody? Not really, it's really, wow, Whoa. that's gross. Maybe you're not supposed to do that. I'm gonna wash my hands like so much after this is done. That should work, why not? They're sharks. Well guys, I think that's gonna wrap up today's video, which was a video that lasted, I don't know, almost two days, basically 24 hours in the car. Um, did some fishing today, did some relaxing on the beach. Um, Heidi and I are pooped. We are pooped. Let's just say tomorrow, we gotta be rested because we got a little bit of traveling we have to do. Uh, we're, we're gonna be fishing for a fish that um, has been on my bucket list for a very long time. Um, it's very similar to a species of fish that we targeted last summer pretty hard, so I think you guys could probably guess it, but we are in Florida, and um, yeah, pretty excited to, to go do that, but the saltwater fish today did not cooperate. 
but that's how it is. Hopefully, can figure something out, but um, for the most part, this is more of a vacation, not so much a fishing trip, so we'll see what happens. I'll pull up the camera anytime anything uh, cool happens, but so far it feels great to be in Florida. How about it, Heidi? I love it. He <laughs> loves it, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Way better than, uh, the, than ice fishing, so it's gonna end up end today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and uh, hopefully we get into some fish soon.